Now, but first we're going to check in with Annika John. She's outside the church office building in downtown Salt Lake City right now looking at what the church will do next. Annika. With President Ballard passing away, it now raises the question of what happens next? What does the church now do that the acting president of the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles has passed away? President M. Russell Ballard served in the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles for 38 years, five of which he served as the acting president under Dallin H. Oaks, who served in the first presidency as the president of the Twelve. In an interview from 2010, Elder David A. Bednar described the role of an apostle as the same as it was anciently. They serve as missionaries bearing testimony of Jesus Christ. The role of an apostle is to focus on individuals and families and bear witness of Christ. That is the first, foremost, and major responsibility and function of a member of the Quorum of the Twelve in these days. The acting president, the church says, are tasked with presiding over the weekly gatherings of the Twelve and other services the president of the Quorum cannot attend. Out of the Twelve, the senior most member outside of the first presidency is generally called as the acting president. Now that Ballard passed away, the Quorum is left with only 11 members, meaning the church will be calling someone new to the Quorum and having someone step into the role of acting president if they so choose. And according to the church, the next senior apostle is Elder Jeffrey R. Holland. The church says Elder Ballard served diligently. He leaves behind a legacy of love, devotion to Jesus Christ, and determined faith of the gospel that will be dearly missed. I bear witness that the resurrected Redeemer of mankind loves all of us, and he has promised if we will follow him, he will lead us safely back into the presence of our Heavenly Father, of which I testify. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Now the church has yet to formally announce who will be taking President Ballard's spot as the acting president and as a member of the Quorum of the Twelve. Now in the past, the church has typically waited until general conference to make that announcement, and they usually pick from either high-ranking church positions, such as the 70, or just from the general church population to choose their next apostle. Reporting live from Salt Lake City, Annika Johns, ABC4 News.